This is a Harbor Freight mini lathe and we'll be using it to create a tool like this out of a bolt like this. This tool will be used for adding transmission fluid to an Audi Volkswagen. Here we'll be drilling a hole in the center of this bolt. Normally you would want to start the hole with a center drill, but we don't have one, so instead if you put the drill farther back, um, so it's grabbing the flutes, and just grab it really loosely because you don't want to damage the flutes. And then bring it up to your part. And you should be able to slowly make a divot on the face. You can see it's wobbling a little bit. Eventually it should straighten out once it creates a big enough hole. Now we have a hole there to start. It won't walk on the face as much. We can now take this out so we're not grabbing the flutes anymore. And we should be able to hold a little tighter now. And spin a little faster. There's still a little bit of wobble. But it seems to be cutting well. Uh, once it's in there, you can start using cutting oil. And now the full diameter of the drill is in. And from here we would just drill like you would drill anything else. Now that we have our pilot drilled, we're going to go the bigger bit. This is a 3 16 and it won't weaken the threads very much, but it'll still give us a bigger hole through the bolt. Now we're going to face the head of this bolt with this carbide tool holder that I made so that the glue JB Weld stays on better. The top of this big pen here fits nicely into this vinyl tubing. So we want to put this into the bolt and this diameter out here is 3 8 So we're going to drill it slightly smaller than 3 8 with this to 23 64 so that we can press fit this into the bolt. Now first, we want to just get the full diameter of the drill in there so we can measure the depth better. So I'll just go until the paper stops. Now we have the full diameter of the drill at the beginning of our part. So here we're going to do a countersink to help the JB Weld stick a little bit better. In order to make sure this fits into our press fit on the screw, we're going to get rid of this piece here by grinding it off. Now the plastic almost fits in here, but it's just too small. 
So I'm going to go ahead and drill that all the way out to 3 eighths now. Now that the hole is drilled out, this fits in there a lot better. We're going to sand the tip of this off so that we can get airflow through it now. We're now going to flip it around so we can cut off these threads here because we only need the front half of that bolt. So before we start lathing this with the lathe tool, we're going to cut the um, large part of the bolt off and then just face it with our carbide. So we cut this off with a hacksaw. If it weren't threaded, you'd be able to put the hacksaw on and actually spin the lathe. Um, but that would make the hacksaw move down the thread. So in this case, we just had to cut it off by hand. And now we are ready to face it. After facing this portion, you can see that the hole did go all the way through where we needed it to. But at the end, because of the tool, the threads are a little bit messed up. So I'm going to use a file to clean up that edge out of chamfer and make sure that the threads are good. So although the hole comes through the other side, it's just a little bit, so we're going to clean it up with the 3 16th bit again. Now it goes all the way through. The last operation here will be countersinking to clean it up. Here's our finished product. And this is what we started with. And here is the nozzle that fits inside. So the lathe worked really well for this part. Before we put the green cap on with JB Weld, we're gonna clean the surface with rubbing alcohol to make sure it'll stick. So we'll put some JB Weld on to connect the green part to our bolt and let it dry for about 16 hours. Now we're going to add the JB Weld and put it into the bolt. Now we can add transmission fluid into an Audi Volkswagen because you can't just put it directly in through the top. Well, I hope you liked this video, and if you did, please like and subscribe.